Hey, so today let's go over all the news for AQ Worlds this week. All right, so I'll start off the news this week with Unity getting renamed into Infinity because I, I love confusing names. It's great. So it's a Vision Quest Worlds Infinity. Good. All right. Glad glad we're there now. Uh, War Masters and Theory Crafters should start debating the prophecy of the infinity dragon all right well it i mean it, okay it's cute with the little infinity symbol tail thing but yeah all right so there's that and also the steam page for the game got an update you might notice something's different on this page hey what happened here what happened here <laughs> the month is gone of march that's uh missing just uh it's still 2023 is there so that's good. That's, that's good. This year, maybe? <laughs> Who knows? Uh, yeah, they still got the Unity header art there. They didn't update that. They changed the name of it. Uh, and the name in here also changed. But that's about it. Everything else on the page looks about the same. Not really anything that much different about it. About it. So, yeah. AE is taking the new Infinity logo and taking that to PAX East, it looks like. So, yeah. A little bit of art for the booth. They show laptop, tablet, phone, and art for that. It's good art and interesting looking booth. This thing, at least. I don't know what's going on here with the red. Uh, yeah, anyway. So, what do you guys think of this? What do you think of the logo? I don't know. I think it looks all right. It it could work. It could, could be okay. The Infinity name, Unity. I didn't really like Unity either. So, I have put the same opinion in that I had on Unity for Infinity. It's weird. I don't know. Mistress Worlds. Yeah, whatever. I just want to play it. They call it whatever at this point. Believe it or not, uh, EQ Worlds has been updated every week since 2008. So, like, going on 14, 15 years. Not a single raccoon pet in the game. Not one trash panda. And it looks like they're going to be adding a few. So, hopefully they look good. Hopefully the art's solid. Hopefully they're cute. I'll have to wait and see. Play they do a little paw animation like this. That'd be great. Looking forward to it. Tanukis are not raccoons, by the way. And there's a raccoon on a stick, but that's not, that's not a pet, really. Anyway, uh, Bido here with a new uh, spear. Looks interesting. Part of that uh, set as well, if you haven't seen it. I think it still looks pretty solid as well. Female version of the silver outfit we saw from last week. This is confirmed to be coming in-game and is color custom, so decent seems like alvaro was also posting female versions of outfits as well we got this one that we've seen before in the female form along with this one as well female version of this yeah looking good theronius with a teaser for a legion outfit very big skull on the shoulder there the yeah you got eyeballs on the chest generic looking thing looking legion stuff blue legion blue Let's talk about this on the stream, but I don't think Legion gear has to be blue. Let me know if you agree. In the Let me know if you agree, but I don't think it needs to be blue. If you look at the Nullgast stuff, they're way like a lot of the stuff's color custom. It's it's nice. You look at the Legion stuff. It seems like every art is just like black, blue, black, blue. Maybe that weird green, maybe. But uh, yeah, I don't know. Antism here with a commission set from Heli. This is a, uh, yeah, like a green serpent guy with purple dragon behind it. Oh, very, uh, yes. I haven't seen uh, that kind of keep before. 300 of them. It seems like recently that's a lot. We've been getting a lot of these. A lot, a lot of them. Uh, but uh, yeah, the purple on the face is kind of interesting. Like you got some sort of like sickness or like maybe mana is corrupting you or something like that. Cool look. Akari's been posting a bunch of weapons up on his Twitter. I haven't include a bunch of them in the news but this one's pretty nice and he put a little animation on it so yeah check out his twitter if you haven't uh recently posting uh, different weapons based on different like map art and stuff like that so really interesting to see speaking of weapons and animations here's miri with one pretty cool little light electricity ability thing there yeah very nice also a new spear or a scythe yeah that's not, that's not a spear anyway yep yeah, looking good some katanas these yeah great 
great legion design there uh the chain looks a little wonky but i guess it's going like in one hole and out the other but the hole's kind of doesn't look like the chain with anyway anywho Froat using a new armor what could this be what could this be and lastly are let with some map art that looks like it's based off a different map i can't remember the name of the map i can't remember very many names but yeah anyway looks good Thanks to all the members for supporting the channel, make videos like these possible. Really appreciate that. And thanks for tuning into the news video this week. Sorry, there's not a lot of news. I don't control what gets posted or what what is in the news, so it's not up to me. But uh, yeah, I'm sure we'll get some more stuff. Uh, the, the finale for one of the sagas has been going on for a while. I can't remember the name of it because that's how good the saga is. Uh, yeah, uh, amazing. Uh, that's ending tomorrow, so check that out. I'll be streaming that on Twitch. I hope I hope it's the last part of that saga. They say finale. Does that mean part one of six finale parts? We'll see. We'll find out tomorrow. Anyway, so yeah, I'll stream that on my Twitch. Check that out. Uh, Twitch link in the description. And uh, yeah, hit like, all that stuff. Peace, peace.